buddy, Lawman Mike with WWW Lawman Guitars, and what in the world do we have here? Okay, this guitar is very, very unusual and very, very cool. You're not going to see one like this very often at Lawman uh, Guitars, but uh, when I was able to get this guitar, I uh, was able to figure a lot uh, out about it, and it has got quite the history. This is a 1967 or 1968 Avalon. It's a model AV2T. They were only made in 1967 and 1968. Uh, they were made by Fuji Gen Gaki, which uh, makes high-end guitars even to this day. Uh, back in the 60s, they were the high-end uh, uh, Tisco guys. I mean, if you're having your Conrads made or a lot of your um, uh, Ibanez's back in the day, they were being made in this factory. These were the guys that knew what they were doing and uh, built, built your better made in Japan guitars. Now, again, why am I demoing this, this made in Japan guitar? Well, this is known as the Shags guitar. Now, you're going, Shags? I'm going, yes, Shags. Now, let me tell you a little bit about Shags. Back in the 60s, there was this girl band out of New Hampshire called the Shags. It was three sisters, and they were terrible. Uh, I have to say, I heard on YouTube some of their songs, and it's like, you're kidding. Really? They actually recorded this? Uh, you'll have to go uh, check them out yourself. But you know what? They got a following because Frank Zappa, uh, probably in his own uh, uh, Frank Zappa way, uh, made all kinds of noise about the Shags back in the day when they were around and said, oh, they're unbelievable, they're the great, nobody understands the Shags but me, and I can see why. Uh, but anyway, Frank Zappa made such a huge deal about it, the Shags had kind of a following. And uh, these poor girls, I mean, they were, they were just not that good, but they, they recorded these songs, they, they were part of a family, they were just three sisters, and they took uh, lessons from this guy who had an Avalon, uh, array of guitars. He uh, imported some guitars uh, from Japan called Avalons and uh, so they bought them from him and they played an Avalon guitar just like this and an Avalon bass just like this. I'd love to find the bass and have the set for you but uh, I was able to get a hold of the guitar and you know what it's it's really kitschy and it's it's really uh, unusual. It's not like any other uh, made in Japan guitar I've had. I mean there's there's some similarities but it's actually a, a really cool guitar. I mean it's got kind of a Ventures look but these big sweeping uh, almost burns like uh, 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 horns on this guitar. It's it's got all this faux tiger uh, maple uh, looking uh, uh, finish on it. I mean, it's 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 really cool. And the Shags played it, so of course it's going to be famous. So uh, if you if you Google Shags guitar, you're going to see a lot of information about this. I happen to have one of the originals. Now it's rumored that uh, there's a big manufacturer that makes uh, reproduction guitars. I won't mention them by name. Uh, but uh, they make map guitars and all sorts of different guitars like that. Uh, it's rumored that he's making a Shags guitar. I actually saw one on his website. He owns one just like this, so uh, he probably thought it was so cool. I'm going to make a bunch of reissues. So you're probably going to see these floating around. If you're looking for an original, I got it. Okay, so let's talk about the guitar. It's got two pickups. <laughs> And it's got these single coil, I mean, I've seen these on Conrad's, uh, some of the Tisco's, and, and a lot of different guitars. Uh, they're very strong pickups, they're not weaklings, they're, they're, they're very, very strong. So it, I'm playing it here on the, uh, on the neck uh, side, I put it in between, this little knob here acts as a, a pickup selector. <laughs> So that's the middle position, and then you go all the way to the back. these pickups. Those sound really good. Of course it's got the whammy. 
And it's got everything original on this with one exception, one knob. Wouldn't you know, one knob is missing. I stuck this uh, replacement uh, round, uh, it probably from a, a, a fender base or something, uh, so it kind of fits in there. But I have to admit, I'm missing one knob in all my thousands of knobs I've got in my shop. I didn't have that shags knob. So uh, you're missing one knob, you have to chase that if you end up being the owner. But the guitar is just beautiful. It's got access to the uh, controls back here, which is kind of nice. You don't have to fish them through. Uh, it's, of course, it's got the big heavy neck plate on it. It's got these really high quality tuners. But I got to tell you, look at that headstock. I mean, my goodness, that thing is so cool. It's got this huge uh, uh, string tension uh, thing on here. Uh, it's, it's got inlaid uh, Avalon on there. It's, it's just beautiful. And, and the rosewood fretboard on it is, is very, very nice. And uh, I got to say, it's just, this is a really cool guitar. So if that's not cool enough, we've got also for the Shags guitar, the original Shags guitar hard shell case. Let's check it out. What we've got here is this really cool case. Oh, of course, it's pink. The girl band pink. Uh, it's really, really in remarkable shape from 1967. It's got the plush lining. This is really nice. Uh, it's got nice, ooh, it's very soft. Uh, it's got all the, the dividers that you want to see. Uh, everything is here. Uh, one latch has been replaced, of course, but it's got the original handle. It's got the original hinges. Uh, the ends uh, look like some of the end has been missing. This end is here, this one is not, but uh, really, all in all, it's a very substantial case for, for this guitar. I mean, if you're gonna travel with this guitar, of course you're gonna get something uh, better for it and stick this under the bed, don't, don't travel with this case. Uh, this is the original case, it fits it perfectly. So, uh, for those of you who are the Shags uh, 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 girl band followers, I've got the guitar for you, a 1967 Avalon Shags guitar, comes with a hard shell case, set up perfectly, plays great, everything works on it. Uh, you can only find it here at www.lawmanguitars.com. I hope you'll check in at all of our really cool guitars out. Thanks a lot for watching today.